Okay, first things first, I'm going to get the house smelling really good before my mom gets here. So I have lavender, bergamot, cypress, and clary sage. This is my jam. I am going to make a diffuser blend called Spring Rain that smells absolutely heavenly. It's raining outside, I think it's perfect. I will put a link in the description for you, but I'm gonna show you how to do it first. Okay, this Spring Rain blend is two drops of lavender, three drops of bergamot, two drops of cypress, and then the smell that really takes it to the spring rain level is the clary sage, and that's four drops of clary sage. This is my absolute favorite springtime oil blend. I think you're gonna love it. I'm here in the Potager, and today the weather is full on Normandy, Britannic, spritzy chaos. So we're pausing all the work that we're doing out here in the Potager, and we are awaiting the arrival of my mom. The children are at the end of the driveway. They're so excited. I saw her for about an hour. If you watched that episode where mom leaves town for the first time in forever, uh, I saw her for about an hour before I got my plane out of Chicago. And so she is coming for the week, and I'm really, really excited. The children, I think, if it's possible, are more excited than I am. They are out there with their bikes in the rain, waiting for her to come down the driveway. We can actually hear cars when they're about a half a mile out, so I'm sure they are attuned to what's going on. I just can't wait to smell her and hold her and go thrifting with her and drink wine with her and play in the garden with her. And of course, she's an uber stylist extraordinaire. So I know we're gonna have a riot in the house. I'm going to try to pass the time by sprucing up the garden a little bit. It's a mess, the snow, we just had our last snowfall like seven days ago. So I know the rest of the country is celebrating spring full stop, but we are just kicking it into gear around here. The tulips are about four inches high and we are digging new market rows and rebuilding the deer fence that the snow brought down. There's a lot going on, but I'm actually really thankful to have this time with her. Just stop the work outside, go inside and visit with mom. Here she is. remember many days where we gardened in the rain hey. because we had to I grabbed a rake right by the garage because I knew you'd need me right away <laughs> thank you look at this guy this is oh, my, wow. new, my new toy oh well, I brought my wellies too awesome Being prepared oh my gosh I'm so glad you're here <laughs> Even in, and you got your jud lips on I do I, I had to put my my jud lips okay. on okay and look I'm rocking my it's so horrible we can go in in a minute but I yeah. got my look at this I thought you'd appreciate this Queen Elizabeth nod. Totally. Yeah. With the hat and then the Diana sweater. Yeah. Cool. And the boots. I love it. All in a homage. This is how I picture you at home, just doing what you have to do even if it's raining. Well, that's good. Yeah. To the 93rd birthday. For sure. Well, uh, so what are you doing? Well, we got this new tool called a broad fork. And so I did this the other day and put in carrots and peas. Then I'm going to put birch here just to give it some pretty structure. And then this is a broad, like this is a um, bed preparation rate, which is just fantastic. Loosens it up, but it's fantastic. Yeah. I can't, but I, I'm serious, like it's wet. Yeah. So I love that you grabbed your rake. But actually what I want to do is because the house is so clean, the grandma was coming, um, I haven't done a farmhouse tour for the YouTube audience since Christmas. So I know we want to go thrifting today. Everything's open because spring has sprung in Door County. Mm -hmm. So I'd love to go find some stuff for the, for the house and then stage it. Do a, stage it, do a spring farmhouse tour, and um, have a little fun. And have some red wine, some carbs. That 
that'll invest be into good. all of that. That'll okay? be good. And then love on kids all yes. at the same time. Yeah. Okay. These are in your woods? Have you looked up to see what they are yet? No. Okay. I can't find anything. They're blue. Is this the woods where you found that sink? Yeah, not often you see blue flowers. It's blue pine or lake. Where it's called Lark's Bird. Lark's Bird. Let's go in and put them in a little crock. Okay. One of the little uh, English blue crocks. Being that we live in northern Wisconsin, by the time spring comes around mid-April, I'm about losing my mind. And there's that impulse to just go crazy and spring up the house. So here's my suggestion to you. Resist all temptation to run to Target or the dollar store or wherever you go to get your fix and buy a bunch of made in China springy garbage. Instead, you know what I'm gonna say, Hit the thrift store and go shopping in your own house. Go find some green stuff, some moss, some twigs outside. Bring it all in and play because pretty soon real spring will be here and there will be plenty for you to work with. Now on that note, I went to the thrift store with my mom the other day and found this beautiful reindeer moss wreath. Ironically, this is from Target back in the day but I'm gonna put it on my door and then we're gonna take you around the house and just show you some of these springtime touches that I've added to hold me over until the tulips are blooming and the lilacs are bursting forth and I'm out in the garden every single day. It's not quite time for planting, but there's some really good sales going on at Home Depot and other places, so I'm grabbing herbs to fill the potager. Now they're just sitting in my greenhouse, so I'm actually able to enjoy them because I'm just popping them in little containers around the house. Again, getting my greenery fix because we're still a little pale here in Wisconsin and nothing's really blooming yet. I know so many of you have been following us along on this everyday chateau. French farmhouse fixer-upper project for the last year and a half and I know you're really curious what we're gonna do with this horrible window are we going to make it over like we did the family room yes we are don't worry this is actually going to be a very deep British cottage inspired stone windowsill you can imagine how excited I am for this project stone coming all the way down and around 
herbs hanging, oil painting, oil paintings, <laughs> these windows gone. It's gonna be Marvy. But for right now, I'm just gonna pop these herbs in here. They're gonna keep me happy until everything starts blooming outside and that way they get a little employment before I can put them in the ground. Thrifting season has officially begun and I am in my heyday. Mom and I had a great time. I found these adorable little figurine lamps, male and female. Put them up here with my inkwells and my old books and I found this little cutie which I love because I just think it really helps the room feel old, this little tin match holder. The inkwells are something my mom specializes in. She finds lots of treasures in the UK and has them on her website so I will be sure to put a link in the description for you. But we're gonna go around and continue to fluff the house for spring, and I think you're really gonna enjoy it. Love chocolate boxes and jewelry boxes and I just found this little cutie out thrifting with mom it's so sweet it has the mirror it has this sepia colored print on the front which goes perfectly with some of the other art pieces in this room we don't have a television but we do have computers this room has absolutely nothing there is no entertainment aside from books and a piano going on in this room it's truly a sanctuary I love it that it's such a place for us to just pull in and relax at the end of the day. It's this third room that you can see from the kitchen. It draws you in. It's completely serene. The sun sets on this side. And why don't we go around the room and show you some of the things that we've added for spring. Mom, what drew you to that? Um, I mean, I know, but I, let's talk about what it's you... It's sad and tattered, and it reminds me of that. Instagram feed that I love, English eccentric home. It's just special. 
and it looks like it's like somebody should have thrown it away. But someone saw the beauty in the petty point for one thing for took sure. forever. Yeah, I love it. Yeah, I love that it's a nail head. Ripped. Tragic. The, bottom, the burlap. Yes. Tragic. Tragic. I would have this. I got it first. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna put it right here just because this space is pretty sad right now because I've taken so much into the middle room right. to style that room. Again, this room, like as far as the first floor goes, is kind of the last thought. So we just have the leftovers in here. The colors go really well, considering it's leftovers. I like the black with the black vintage suitcase yeah. and the corner. This is springy. Yeah, for yeah, sure. Springy. Okay, so I'm just gonna put it right there. And this room just is what it it's is done now. until fall, you know, cause we're gonna be outside. Um, but yeah, I love this little guy. <laughs> what is uh what's happening here it's wet it's wet hello pot this is kettle okay well yours is wet too we were out in the rain i know it's like frisball city yeah so great weekend great yes. week actually it was yeah. a whole week it's been fantastic yeah grandma visit home tour red wine resale Resale. I think that we should toast to you keeping the resale shops in business in Door County. Ah, yes, probably. They see you coming. Probably a mile away. Yeah. So this wine is named after your maiden name. Oh, fry. And this is a THM Happy Einkorn. And, and I can't I, I, go. I can't give any responsibility for the carry code because mm -hmm. yellow is better. Yes. It's awesome. Okay. I'm can't fine. wait to have some. Are we doing this again? Are we clink. <laughs> I think we clinked like four times. Oh, sure. Cheers. Okay, cheers. You have to saute. Look. Fresh. Go. Thank you. You wouldn't want me to die from fumes. Mm. This is the new formula. There's no fumes. Yeah. It was way too dirty for anything natural. Can I get your butt? It's tradition. It's not looking really good in these jeans, actually. It actually isn't. Those are terrible. Toilet sinks sinks for hire. Wait, 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 wait. The chandelier is moving. When? When? We have the weather to Okay. Okay, first things Julian. first. Shh. Okay, thank okay. you. Because I haven't seen my mom in months since my last trip a few months ago. Okay, ready? Yeah, no, it's I gotta start over. Yes. You've got like just like a two single strands of hair. Oh, that's really bad. Thank you. And we are waiting the rival. Oh, shoot, ready? Well, it's totally, you know, the feed, the Instagram feed. I love English centric home. Yes. English. 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 Accent. No. They are out there with their bikes in the rain. They are out there in their bikes in the rain waiting for grandma. In their and bikes? 
May I hang, may I hang the moth? Okay, hang the it. Brief. The moth. The moth. Brief. Okay, and... Go. Okay. Sorry. Thank you. You're alive. Am I? Will I do up my zipper? XYZ PQ. <laughs> okay. Dang it! And digging new market rows. And mom, you can't do that while I'm talking because you're shaking the camera. Okay. Centric. Eccentric? Yeah, I think it's eccentric. It's ECC. <laughs> it English centric. I've been saying it wrong the oh, whole well. time. I'm like, what does centric mean? Yeah. Okay. And I say yeah. that you do an excellent job keeping the resale shops going in Montgomery County. <laughs> Is this the woods where you found that sink? Oh, that doesn't sound this right. looks it like the hill that you drove. What is this frizzy hair? Oh, yeah, this is pot calling kettle black. Yeah. No. <laughs> I'm the pot calling the kettle black. I don't. I don't get. The, I don't. I can't. What? Hello, Hello pot. This is kettle. Hello pot. This is kettle. Okay, go. What is this? No laugh. <laughs> Gosh, my pants are falling off. Farm That's... hair don't care. Farm hair don't care. <laughs> My daughter's name is Patisserie Amelie. <laughs> so what's next? I liked the I can see you coming, and I said a mile away. Oh yeah, okay. Stop. No, because that was really good. Wait, yeah. you put stand up straight. You're not gonna be happy with that. You know, I mean, don't be. What was I before? It. Was I slouched? No, I have no idea. Okay. But you I know it's not your all time. Yeah, you're yeah. gonna be no, but, Yeah, no, but I gotta start over. <laughs> yeah, we were out in the rain. Yeah, it's like frizzball city out there for sure. Yeah, even though it was a warm rain. Cheers. Okay. To the Graham office, the tour, okay, spring tour, which yep. was fabulous. That was week. Hit me again, Ike.